This is the Coastal Bend's most comprehensive high school football show. Friday Night Fever, proudly brought to you by CCRV, keeping RVs affordable and fun. All right, welcome back to our special playoff edition of the Friday Night Fever. It's been an action-packed night already, and Nikila Pertier joins us now, and you yep. got to go up to Beeville for a battle of unbeaten Battle Woodsboro. of unbeaten yeah. Woodsboro. How about those Eagles, man? They had a great season so far this year. They have. Yeah. 12 and 0, undefeated, yeah, right. going up against another undefeated team, as you mentioned, Fall City Beavers. So two heavyweights here in that, that class two weight. Well, you know, you were there. it was my pleasure to yeah. be there. All right, <laughs> let's go ahead and take you to Beeville again. The clash between Woodsboro and Fall City. You see the Eagles coming out all fired up. A good crowd on hand, too, to support the home team technically today in Fall City. Uh, you see filing onto the field. Now, uh, early in the game, uh, the Caleb Jokic, the, the, the quarterback for um, Unfortunately, throws a quarterback, picked off by Fall City linebacker. The Beavers take advantage. That guy you see running there, yes. quarterback Keyshawn Johnson. Yes, that's really his name. Keyshawn Johnson <laughs> takes it 50-plus yards days. for the touchdown after a two-point conversion. Fall City up early, 8 to nothing. But the Eagles defense trying to turn things around. Next Beavers possession, Woodsboro there. You see they force the fumble, force a fumble, and Tony Meacham falls on top of it. Big play there for the Woodsboro D. Unfortunately, just two plays later, Quarterback Jokic um, had a fumble of his own, and you can see there the mystery man, number seven, running it back. Scoop and score after another successful two-point conversion. Fall City up 16 to nothing at that point. Now in the second quarter, Fall City up at this point 22 to nothing, Allen, and you see number seven there again. Big run, breaks it out for 69 Man. yards, makes it down to the 10-yard line there. Touchdown saving tackle that make it first and goal, but it got to fourth and goal, and there you see the big man senior, Garrett Burns, Able to sack Keyshawn Johnson, who was very elusive tonight. Woodsboro gets the ball on downs, but the defense not done yet. Fall City driving again. They force another fumble here at the four-yard line, and they're able to stop the drive. But the offense just couldn't cash in on those turnovers tonight. And just before halftime, Keyshawn Johnson, again, big factor this game, gets it in 10 yards out for another score at this point. It was 30 to nothing. This mm. was just before halftime. And Woodsboro's offense just couldn't make it happen tonight. They fall 50 to nothing. Shutout. Wow in their final game of the season. Still, you know, a great, great season for the Eagles. Again, undefeated. And, you know, as we mentioned uh, earlier, you mm -hmm. know, they got back-to-back -back district titles, first time since 81, you know, when these kids weren't even a twinkle in their parents' <laughs> eyes. So, know. you know, all in all, I think. I was think, in college then, believe yeah, it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So I would say all in all, you know, they, they still had a very successful season, but I'm sure it was tough to go out this way right. tonight. Well, good job, Tequila. And again, congratulations to Woodsboro on a, on a tremendous season.